One weather forecaster here for NBC 5 News, Aaron Nilsson, and it's warm, uh, dare I say hot. I know it's been hot, especially in the car, definitely hot. It's that time of year, get the sun shade up, be careful of what you have inside, whether it be groceries, kids <laughs> or animals, really don't leave it in there. Overnight is probably okay because it's getting down in the 50s, but yeah, be careful. Satellite radar is showing not really much activity. Uh, a little bit there off, but looks like between Brookings and Gold Beach. Some clouds south of Crescent City, you know, east over here, Christmas Valley, and then east of there. But really, not a lot happening right now, but there is some stuff on the way. We do have a heat advisory. It's until 11 p.m. Sunday. As that reminder just said there, the kids and pets, the vehicle bring plenty of fluids. I mean, just sitting here, the sun's not beating on me. I'm just constantly thirsty. But the entire area, that orange, pretty much under that advisory. And the Chetco effect happening there on the coast as well. Clear and breezy for you on the coast. Upper 50s, low 60s for those tonight. And then for tomorrow, warm. You see that 80s. Crest City only 76. But yeah, a lot of 80s there for tomorrow. Sunny day, good time to probably get out to some water with it being Mother's Day. West Valley is clear and breezy tonight. Got a lot of 50s. Roseburg gets a 60. Excuse me, Mount Shasta down to 49. And tomorrow you see those numbers already sunny and hot because we're going to have some 90s. Medford, Ashland, who knows? You might get up to it. Happy Camp up here. And then Roseburg showing 98. <laughs> All right. Good luck with that. It's only May. East of the Cascades, we're looking at clear tonight, but then gusts of 20 miles an hour. 40s Paisley though 50 everyone will be in the 40s tonight and tomorrow thunderstorm chance for you and those gusts we're looking at 33 miles an hour a lot of 70s Cray Lake though only get up to 62. Now as we get to the 70 forecast it's pretty simple we get to this time of year and it's it's like well it's going to be sunny and hot and some thunderstorm chances and we do have that for the Rogue Valley. Slight chance on Monday and Saturday. Otherwise, Tuesday through Friday will be sunny, maybe partly cloudy, mostly in the upper 80s for those highs and those 50s for those lows. Clam Falls, you're looking at 20% chance for tomorrow and Monday, and then slight chances next Friday and Saturday, where Tuesday to Thursday will be your little gap and break for many chances of thunderstorms or rain. You'll be peaking at 85 on Friday and mostly in the 40s for your lows. Looking at Northern California, Mother's Day tomorrow, again, everybody, not just Northern California, and you're having 20% tomorrow and 10% on Monday, and then you should be pretty clear the rest of the week, Tuesday through Saturday, no threat really of any thunderstorms after Monday, and you're going to be in the 80s most of the week and 50s all week for your lows. And finally, for the coast, you have a heat advisor tomorrow, otherwise just AM fog on Monday, and then it's going to be partly cloudy the remainder of the week. Comfortable and cool in the 60s, and those lows down to the lowest of 50.